Drew, can you tell me about the new starting pitchers the Mariners have? Well, a group that struggled and we were very critical of, especially mm-hmm. towards the end end of the year we were very critical of, got, had, does have some new faces. Mariners most recently picked up a, a pitcher with an absolutely fantastic first name. Yeah. Andrew Smiley. <laughs> 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 he's a tall lefty. Uh, he's played five seasons in the bigs. A 3.82 career and run average, five, 552 strikeouts, 161 walks. I mean, guy throws strikes. He yes. doesn't walk a lot of guys. I mean, that's half the battle. You know, he can't put guys on base. That's what killed the Mariners half the time last year was just giving guys free most bases, those guys scoring. Yeah, yep. most of the time that's what ended up killing him. <laughs> the M's, the end, the M's also picked up uh, Giovanni Gallardo. Uh, he's a 10-year veteran, career 3.84 ERA, uh, 1,432 strikeouts, 603 walks, coming off a year where he had 5.04 ERA. So he got... He got tied Roughed up a little bit, a little bit, but it's okay. Uh, he's a member of the Orioles, very small ballpark, so a hitter's park. But you know, five four is still a lot. Could be a solid number five starter for the team. But what I did notice about both these two guys, we said the magic number last year for the M's was about two, two and a half runs a game given up would give them probably about the wins they need to get in the playoffs. And both <clears> these guys are over that, so I'm hoping for them to have better years if we want to see the M's anywhere near the postseason. Yeah, coming I, up I, this next year. Yeah, and them stop being the. Uh, that an- that annoying ex girlfriend we all hate. Mm. <laughs> I'm yeah. glad you said it. <laughs> I, I know it's true. Seriously. So it, explain that analogy for us so, so that yeah. we, we, that we get it. For we those who don't know, we for those who don't know, never had an ex before. Yeah, for those who aren't lifelong listeners to the show, like you know, you know, we hope everyone is. You guys <laughs> tune in. Uh, um, basically, we've called Family. the Mariners that annoying ex girlfriend. They play with your heart a little bit, text you every once in a while, make you think you want to be with them again. And then they just end up breaking your heart in the end again. I fall for it wonder, every year. Yeah, then you wonder why you fell for it again yep. and again and again. And you know what? The next year you're like, oh, no, it's going to be different this time with them. It's going to be different this time with her. It's not. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. It's not. Christian sitting here shaking his head because he, he just hopes that this time around it's going to be different. She's Christian, a tease. I'm, with you, I'm Christian. sorry. She's a tease. <laughs> she's just playing with your heart, brother. Break up with her. Uh-huh. I'm telling you. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. No, nope. too we much entertainment. To to I'm too, <laughs> break up with her. too entertained, bad or good. I'm too entertained by the Mariners. I can't, I can't yeah. not stay away. Like you said, the M's added. I mean, they've added a bunch of guys as well that we didn't even talk about for for depth for this rotation. Uh, if the starting pitching cr- pitching group can stay healthy, which they failed to do last year, Felix Hernandez was hurt. There's just a bunch of guys who were hurt all year long and yeah. they couldn't they couldn't put it together. So it should be an interesting group to watch to see you know how that works out. 